The default cursor on Roblox can look very basic, but in this video, I'm going to show you how you can have your own custom cursor on Roblox for free. The first thing you want to do is to go to any Roblox game and make sure it's on the latest version. To do this, all you have to do, go to any Roblox game, click play, all right? And this will make sure that everything's up to date. So if it says upgrading Roblox, that's good. It means that it's getting it to the latest version. Now you want to head over to osuskinner.com. I'll link this down below in the description. But once you get here, just click this red button, get started. Okay, now this might look a little complicated, but don't worry. All you have to do is go down and see where it says cursor. Click on that. And then you will be brought to all of these cursors. You can choose whatever you like. And I'm also going to, it's also the same thing for shift lock. I'm going to show you how to change your shift lock cursor as well. And basically, you just want to go to any cursor, you know, they have multiple pages, and just choose whatever cursor you want will work. All right, for example, I'm just going to do this one right here. Do not click this. All right, if you do by accident, just click here, selection over here, but go, hover right over the cursor you want, right click. See where it says save image as you click it. Then you want to go to pictures or you can store anywhere, but pictures is probably preferred. And then just click save. Once you do that, you just want to go to pixlr.com and I'll link this down below in the description as well, but just click create new, set the width to 60 and the height to 60. Okay. Once you've done that, click create. All right, now you be with this uh, blank transparent template. Now find your cursor. For example, mine's in pictures. You want to drag drag this right here all right click add current and there it is it will based on how big it is how much it takes up you know typically you don't want it to be too big but this is also one of the smaller ones but whatever size you want if you want to compare it to the normal roblox cursor click the windows button on your keyboard go to the roblox player right click hover over more then open file location this might look different on windows 11 etc but just open file location all right, then open file location on the Roblox player again. Go to content, textures, and then you want to find the folder that says cursors. You want to click on this one right here. And then you go to keyboard and mouse. And here is the one. See, this mine's different because these are the custom cursors I already currently used. Uh, you just want to drop it on uh whatever you want to compare it to the one this is i know this is a uh, other custom cursor but typically you would have if you have a default cursor the default cursor would show up and then you can compare it to the one you have here just make sure the one you have here is exactly in the middle now you want to go to file click save all right and then you want to just click save as put it in the same folder as the one you already you know save your other cursor as just name it whatever you want and there we go now that you saved it what you want to do same thing as before you want to go to roblox player right click more uh, open file location open file location again content textures cursors folder and then you'll be brought back to here now you want to click on the keyboard and mouse folder right under gamepad it could be different but just keyboard and mouse folder and then you see these two, these will be the default cursors for you. Now that you're here, go to your, over your file explorer, right click, click it again so you can open another file explorer. Then go to wherever you saved it, for me it's pictures. And then you just want to rename it to the exact same names as here. So this is the cursor I downloaded. In fact, you want to duplicate that. So see this one here, not the one, the original one, not the one from Osu, but this one right here that you downloaded from Pixlr. All right, then you want to hold control. And then just drag it so you get two of them. Rename one of them to arrow cursor, capital A, capital C, arrow cursor. It has to be very exact, or else it won't work. Then the other one, arrow bar cursor. Remember with the capitals. And then once you name both of them, you want to select them by clicking control on the other one. You get them both, put it in this folder, then click replace the files in this destination. And there we go. Now you should have the cursors, but you're not done yet because these are just the normal cursors, but you also want shift lock, right? You just want to duplicate it and make sure you still have another one in the last folder. I actually put all of them in here, but you can just duplicate it, put it in the folder. And now what you want to do now for the shift lock, you want to same thing as before, open file location. All right. You know, you already done this open file location, content, textures. And now what you want to do 
is you want to scroll down, scroll down until you see mouse locked cursor. Again, this will show a shift lock icon. For mine, it's the custom cursor I already use. Find this, all right, and then see the folder down here. You want to rename it to the exact same one as before. Mouse locked cursor, all right? So mouse locked cursor. All right, enter. There we go. Now you want to drag this into this folder right here. This will change right here. And by the way, you can do different cursors for different. If you want to like get a new cursor from Osu Skinner and like just change that, you know, you can always have different uh, shift locks than cursors. You know, a lot of people do that. But anyways, just drag it in there. Click replace file, and there we go. You should have your shift lock. Now all you have to do is close out of everything to test it out. Go to any Roblox game. Click join and you should have your cursors and shift lock. And uh, yeah, comment down below if you have any questions. I'll be glad to help you. You know, like the video if this worked for you. Subscribe if this helped you out. Again, watch the video over. If, I know it could be complicated for some of you. And by the way, this cursor will reset once Roblox updates. Roblox updates kind of often. So you just want to go back to this video once you realize your cursor has been reset and do the same process soon. You will get really good at it and you can just do it really fast because when roblox updates then they reset like all the files so then this would be the default one again thank you so much for watching i will see you in the next one spoof gaming out